Well, was I imagine all in all a uh, disappointing evening tonight? Yeah, it's probably an easy way to sum it up, really. Yeah, the, obviously came here to win. We got down to ten men early days. And yeah, it's just uh, it's a frustrating one for us because it's eleven v ten, you know, and it's you automatically start dropping. But even at that, I think the boys had a good account of themselves. And the ref makes some interesting decisions like he did tonight. Do you sometimes think maybe it's just not going to be our day? Yeah, I think the ref was poor to be fair. Um, yeah, look, there is or is. Sometimes things go against us. You go, we got down to 10 men. It was a questionable red card. Look, you know, it happens in football. We have to get on and we did. To be fair, we handed it out all the way to the last minute. It's probably just sickening, really, to go out like that. About 75 minutes with 10 men. Um, I know you don't want to really take positive straight after the game, but I suppose the defensive performance from that on was impressive. Yeah, well, that's credit to the staff, if I'm honest, because we do it in training now and again, you know, 10v11, 10v9 sometimes. <coughs> so um, it wasn't something that we're not used to. Obviously, the length of time maybe was something for the boys' legs and I think mentally trying to stay switched on is the toughest part. Um, but look, yeah, the boys worked hard, devastated without a cup, but we have the league to concentrate on now on the checker trade. You mentioned the league there and it's full focus on the league. I suppose the nature of the defeat tonight just gives that added bit of, of desire to win at the weekend. Definitely, yeah. Look, we have a lot of games coming up. It's a tough period. Everybody knows Christmas coming up and it's always a tough period and it's the business end. Um, def we're we're, we're going to be going at them Saturday, you know, we're going to have a right go like we always do get the fans behind us on our home ground and that's what we'll do, we'll have a good go. The squad's going to all be needed, the, some players play tonight that perhaps haven't got the games they wanted to, but you know, moving forward they're all going to be needed. Definitely, we've said it since day one, since um, the gaffer came into the building, we've said it, everybody's got to be needed, um, no doubt about it. 120 minutes for some of the boys who haven't played much and they looked, we looked fit enough to be fair. Um, but yeah, it was, Saturday will, will Saturday will be Saturday, you know, the gaffer will pick the team that he thinks has got to win and we'll all stick on board and stick with him. I suppose for yourself, the pride when the gaffer does give the armband, at your age it must be quite a proud moment for you. Definitely, yeah, a little, little another milestone in my career. Um, I said before, there's other boys in there who could have got it easily. Um, but yeah, it's nice to, to see the gaffer trust me with that responsibility. and. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm very happy where my family will be as well, I'd, I'd say. I imagine as sort of having that leadership mentality, the, the one thing for you and defenders moving forward is probably start to keep a, a few clean sheets. Yeah, I think that's what we're missing and we're lacking. Um, we've noted it. It's the first thing on the defenders list now. Um, the staff have said it to us. And we're working really hard to stop the silly goals and if a team does score, it has to be a good goal or a worldie. Um, and we put our hands up to them if they if they do go in. But the silly goals are, are maybe our fault, and not today's game, but maybe in general the past few games that we conceded. Um, we get that out of our game. We have a really really chance to to, to do something this season.